Hmm. Interesting. Okay, let's go. Now this is totally different now. Quirky opening. So just going to just try and keep a good baseline. Don't get too creative. Try and look logically at this thing. If the creative comes in, then that's fine. We'll try and get the creative logicalized. So the night's on the rim at the minute, but it's not too dim per se. Move the bishop again. Could touch on there. Don't know if I'm attacking that with the bishop or not. I'm trying not to lose tempo, I want to develop pieces. Yeah, so it's not too dim, it's gone back in. Could lead on it, just x raying through to the bishop. I don't know what that's worth really though. If we go here, he's just going to push the pawn on. Yeah, so chasing it around, he's just going to bounce to here, then he's attacking this pawn as well. So we might as well just either block off this pawn also blocking off our bishop yeah let's do that okay so <clears throat> bring out the old school bit of a lockdown for a second it's advancing the pawn up oh no we've got trouble we've opened up the dark square bishop diagonal damn I'm gonna bring the bishop here so if he does do that then we can take it okay so he's locked himself down so we could challenge the pawn, see if he wants to take or if he just pushes past whichever way. So trying to maintain some sort of pressure but logically looking at the, um, the creativity. Because I can see I'm overextending now with my pawns, I don't really like that. Could go there but then his knight can take. I'm going to try and open this way and then this um, scrupulous beast is going to come through, yep. Yeah. Develop my knight, white square bishop, what's my knight doing here? So he's got it all jammed down really, but I suppose he's not developing. Come here to attack his knight? No, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Just go here for now. Looks a bit messy really. It's because he's done the quirky opening type thing and maybe I've fallen for it because I've overextended in a way and it's not really in it doesn't look like a nice position because at the minute he's got his little piddly pawns protecting his areas so we don't really have anywhere to go now he's coming down on our king's side so I'm gonna have to do the blocking the scud missile lazy man tactics but it can also turn out quite good if they start pushing forward mm-hmm so this is why we don't really like this type of opening really want the knight coming here but his knight is protecting that area his knight's just going to do a merry dance all over my king what am i going to do now this is my creative brain going crazy like crazy now logically do i need to worry about anything is he actually doing anything to me that's the question realistically can come here with my queen but then his bishop just comes and um, parries it out of the way can come here with the queen just looking to see if we can get a stealther but his bishop's just going to come here and attack so we're going to have to bring the bishop here so we're, we're trying to instigate some trouble his knight's going to be blocking he's making his way towards our king area yeah issues issues yeah knight probably just jumps in now saying well look i'm here maybe take with the knight and he's got two knights there look on this on this That's surreal can't this bishop get some action going he could if it went like this but he's gonna see that but i'm not overthinking any of the other areas because he's got the knights there waiting to just jump in so we might as well try and go for a cheapie, which is this here. Pawn can't take it back. But I don't think we're going to get away with it. Is he 
he going to give his knight up? I don't know, not too sure. Does the rook come down? What can stop that? Queen's come down, now the queen's got this diagonal here logically. We've got the knight that can protect that area. So we could still go through with the bishop taking the pawn here. Uncontested at the moment. So he's going queenside castling, isn't he? So if we bring this here, a bit of an annoying pin on the knight through to the queen. Is that going to work? So in a sense I'm trying to get pieces to protect my king Gary because he's got... Oh my word, he's started already. What did he say? <clears throat> so we could bring the bishop back. Like we said, if his knight takes, then our knight can take. Then at least we've circumvented one piece that he's looking to cause trouble. Is there anything better? What's my queen doing? Queen can still come here. There's no threat of the bishop coming to attack it now. So it gives them something to think about, doesn't it? Can always take his bishop as well. So if he drops the pawn, we take with our pawn. Is that a nice position though? We take with our pawn. Well, let me just go here. Then he drops his pawn. Can't even do it right. Goes here. Then he drops his pawn. We can take with our pawn. It's just he's got this knight here. That's the thing. Take with our pawn, and then we don't have the x ray through, so then his bishop can take our bishop for free. That's not going to work, so we might as well take the bishop first, should we? But then if we take the bishop first, this pawn takes. Maybe even his knight takes. And then his queen's got this here. <laughs> what have we created? So am I coming back down to doing this bishop move? After all that, I think bishop move looks best. If he does take... Then the knight takes... We're on this pawn, his bishop's there, so I don't know if his bishop will want to stay there or not. <sighs> There's no bishop to just gonna bring the bishop here, x ray through to the queen. I think we talked through all of those. Right, time wise now four minutes, the opponents in seven minutes. Okay. I think we covered off quite a few pathways there. The opponent doesn't have to do anything of those, so we'll have to recalculate depending on what they do. And this is too many pieces on the board at the moment as it is. Don't really like having pieces on the board. Oh, and he's castled. Oh, the queen can squeeze in. No, it can't. <laughs> I thought I had there, but it's not there. It's, I have to go here first. So he's not interested in that. In that. So the bishop can take with a check on his king. Pawn takes. Queen, queen can't take. <laughs> Or knight takes, but knight's not going to take, so the pawn will take, but I can't take back. Bishop takes, pawn takes, mm, the picture's not looking too rosy. If we take here, then opens up, I don't really want to do that, do I? Queen coming here now, attacking this pawn which is protected by their queen at the moment. Also got a diagonal here, looking for an exchange with the queen, are they going to be happy with that? Does that cut? No, it's the bishop! What am I doing? Got to think of the bishop here. I think I'm going to have to take this bishop off the board, it's just that it opens up this rook in front of my king. I don't think is it dangerous? Let's look logically. Is it dangerous? Yeah. So we take. Pawn takes. 
the rook's got the file, but it's got a pawn in front. Maybe his pawn doesn't take it, but the knight's not going to take because the bishop's got there. We've gone through all of that. We take take, and then the queen can move up here. But I'm moving away from my king. That's causing issues, so I'm, I'm taking it off the board. We keep coming back to that bishop, so we might as well just take it off. And then we could take this knight off here. Because then if the queen takes, then we can take the pawn with a check here. So I'm going to do that and keep it simple. Because that was the concern, being not being able to take this pawn. So we might as well just do that. I was getting way too arty with the queen coming up to the far side and all that. It might be totally wrong. I might be missing something. Looks like they're taking the time over this move now. Right, we're on 2 minutes and 26, there is no increment so we have to move a bit faster but it's always good to talk it through, let's put the check on like we said do have a spare pawn here but I don't know if I'm pawn grabbing or not depends if he wants to exchange or if he just simply moves his king does that give us a better position, our rook now this is all different now so we have to do a recalculation rook can come up here to attack the queen could do that just to get it across here or we could look to exchange the queens off what's the scores on the doors plus two plus two at the moment so we could look to exchange but is that going to be dangerous do I go here and then he goes boom it's got a knight right in front of my king you know I've got to be careful go for it just keep it simple one minute 54 we're going to have to just bullet this thing out now we've got a pawn in front of our king let's just chill pawn take no rook take maybe double the pawns potentially or swing the rook through rooks have no place in the center of the board got to remember unless he's giving us a check on his king for now that might have been bait um, let's come here see if we grab this he's going to push down defending I think they move, yeah he's pushed down defending, they move quick because they, my time is running out so I'm just going here. Come on keep my pieces tight, oh look at this now, this is, you know I could, no well not win the bishop but Go here. Go there. And then go here for checkmate. Nearly. I think it is. Oh man, I thought he couldn't get out the side there. Oh, bummer. Oh. Damn, that's messed that up now. Now I'm just winging it now. Oh, he's going to escape around the side here as well. Oh, shabby times. What, 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 what? Oh, that's a damn shame. Oh, scandalous, scandalous. That ain't right, that ain't right. Oh, his bishop's protecting now as well. What am I on? 49 seconds. Oh, it's too tight. It's too tight. No protection on the knight. Oh dear. Well, um, he's escaping like an escape artist. Look, he's like Houdini. Takes the palm. 
Oh, the mic. Taste the palm. Taste the ear. Taste the palm. Doesn't take the palm. I don't even know what I can't even see where I can go. He's escaping all over the place here. It's there. We could go across the top. Where can this knight do something? Maybe take a rook off. Get me! I 